an asteroid was discovered coming into our solar system. Let that sink in. An asteroid was discovered coming into our solar system. From where, we don't know. It just came from outside our solar system, meaning it's from a different star system somewhere else. That's historic, that we've actually seen it. We now know objects can travel from one star system to another. If there's one celestial object that has captivated the scientific community, it's Oumuamua. From the moment it appeared on our radar, this mysterious object sparked intense interest. Over the years, as scientists uncovered fascinating details about its unique characteristics, Oumuamua became one of the most discussed and studied phenomena in space exploration. Yet, technology at the time wasn't advanced enough to capture its appearance until the James Webb Space Telescope arrived. How did James Webb manage to capture Oumuamua despite its immense distance? Where is this enigmatic object now? And what groundbreaking insights have scientists gained from its first ever real image? Join us in this video as we reveal how the James Webb Telescope unveiled unprecedented details about Oumuamua. Oumuamua is the first known object to enter our solar system from interstellar space. Initially considered an ordinary asteroid, its peculiar traits soon told a different story. Unlike typical asteroids, which are spherical or irregularly shaped, Oumuamua displayed a distinctive cigar-like shape. Even more unusual was its smooth, deliberate motion through space, moving at an astonishing speed. From the moment it entered our solar system, astronomers recognized that its velocity was too great to belong to an asteroid. Unlike asteroids and planets, which orbit the Sun at relatively slow speeds, Oumuamua wasn't gravitationally bound to the Sun and instead followed a unique trajectory. Never before had any known space object behaved like this. The fact that it originated from interstellar space added to its intrigue. Typically, humanity sends probes like Voyager 1 to explore the far reaches of interstellar space. The appearance of an interstellar object in our solar system was unprecedented, offering scientists an extraordinary opportunity. Oumuamua was first detected on October 19, 2017 by Robert Warrick at the Haleakala Observatory using the Pan-STARRS telescope. The object's flashing appearance on the radar signaled something extraordinary, and the team quickly named it Oumuamua, which means messenger from afar in Hawaiian. The discovery was monumental, marking humanity's first encounter with an interstellar visitor. But it was also met with unease. Oumuamua appeared to be heading straight for Earth. This sparked widespread speculation, including theories that it might be an asteroid on a collision course or even an alien spacecraft in disguise. As scientists studied Oumuamua, they ruled out the asteroid hypothesis due to its unusual acceleration and lack of the chaotic motion typical of such objects. Some proposed it was a comet, but this theory faltered as well. Oumuamua lacked a comet's characteristic tail or outgassing. The alien spacecraft theory gained traction when astronomers noticed it accelerated unexpectedly as it neared the Sun on September 9, 2017, reaching speeds of 196,000 miles per hour. This maneuver appeared deliberate, leading some to theorize it was powered by solar radiation or built by an advanced alien civilization. Eventually, the mystery was resolved. Oumuamua's acceleration was likely caused by hydrogen gas escaping from its surface as it warmed near the sun. Rather than an alien craft, it turned out to be a unique fragment of a distant interstellar planet. Its behavior was unlike anything in our solar system, simply because it came from beyond it. The real breakthrough came with the James Webb Space Telescope, which provided the first actual images of Oumuamua. This was a significant milestone in understanding this extraordinary object. Since its launch, the James Webb Telescope has revolutionized the study of interstellar objects. Equipped with advanced infrared imaging technology, it can detect hidden details invisible to other telescopes, offering new insights into the earliest stars and galaxies formed after the Big Bang. James Webb's high-resolution, ultra-sensitive instruments allow it to observe even the faintest celestial objects with remarkable clarity. By analyzing interstellar components in unprecedented detail, it has transformed the way we explore and understand the cosmos. Infrared imaging also allows for the detection of the chemical compositions of distant objects, painting vivid pictures of phenomena that were once beyond our reach. 
With its unique capabilities, the James Webb Telescope has dramatically increased the pace of space discoveries, unveiling marvels like the Phantom Galaxy and the Southern Ring Nebula. Its ability to merge countless images into detailed composites ensures that scientists have access to unparalleled views of distant celestial wonders. The first real image of Oumuamua represents a new chapter in our understanding of interstellar phenomena. Thanks to the James Webb Space Telescope, the mysteries of this extraordinary visitor and the cosmos at large are finally coming into focus. This space breakthrough has opened up a realm of possibilities that allows us to push the boundaries of our knowledge and understanding of the universe. Although the James Webb Telescope has proven to be the best scientific breakthrough so far for space study, we can't ignore the value of other important tools like the Pan-STARRS Telescope. After all, the Pan-STARRS Telescope discovered the Oumuamua in the first place. James Webb was only utilized to further research on the Oumuamua, because it was best suited for that purpose. The Pan-STARRS Telescope is stationed at the summit of Haleakala, on the beautiful island of Maui, Hawaii. This telescope is the core player in the ambitious Pan-STARRS project. The Pan-STARRS project is a collaborative project involving esteemed institutions with a core goal of monitoring the sky for any strange astronomical phenomena, especially those that can potentially cause impact events. The Pan-STARRS-1 telescope is part of an elaborate system designed for wide-field astronomical imaging. Its primary task is to conduct comprehensive night sky surveys and capture celestial objects in optical wavelengths. The telescope tirelessly scans the cosmos, from distant galaxies to elusive comets and asteroids, as it documents the wonders that populate our vast universe. It also surveys carefully to spot any objects that seem like potential threats to Earth. The Pan-STARRS relies upon its special PS1 Image Processing Pipeline, IP, to manage the immense volume of data collected during these surveys. IP is a cutting-edge software that allows the space telescope to automatically process and analyze vast amounts of observational data. Astronomers can then use advanced algorithms and computational techniques to uncover the secrets hidden within the thousands of celestial images captured by Pan-STARRS. One remarkable aspect of the Pan-STARRS telescope is its pivotal role in the Pan-STARRS Near-Earth Object Survey. This initiative is part of the Pan-STARRS project, focusing on scanning the entire sky to identify near-Earth objects that might collide with our planet. This was how Oumuamua was discovered. Interestingly, the Pan-STARRS wasn't explicitly searching for Oumuamua. It stumbled upon it while performing its routine observations. Given the nature of Pan-STARRS' mission, researchers initially thought Oumuamua was an asteroid heading toward Earth. After all, most space objects in our solar system are asteroids, and Oumuamua appeared to be one at first glance. However, as scientists collected and analyzed more data, they realized this mysterious interstellar traveler was no ordinary asteroid. It defied all the known and established patterns of asteroid behavior. For instance, Oumuamua could abruptly change its trajectory through space. What initially seemed to be a collision course with Earth suddenly shifted, almost as if the object knew it had been detected. Things took a surprising turn when scientists discovered that Oumuamua's speed was extraordinarily high. They realized they needed to act urgently, or this unique object would escape without leaving sufficient data for study. Time was of the essence, as researchers had only 11 days to gather as much information as possible about this strange visitor before it drifted away for good. Recognizing the critical nature of the opportunity, the team at Pan-STARRS sought assistance from NASA. NASA quickly deployed advanced telescopes to measure Oumuamua's dimensions, color, and brightness in detail. Every aspect of the object's surface and structure was crucial, so no detail was overlooked. NASA scientists prioritized data collection, leaving in-depth analysis for later. Everyone understood that once Oumuamua exited the solar system, the chance to study it would be lost forever. They were right. Since its departure, there has been no way to contact or track it. An intriguing mystery surrounds the interstellar object known as Oumuamua, as it seems to exhibit an invisible force actively propelling or steering it. Many still speculate that Oumuamua was, in fact, an alien space probe. If this were true, perhaps it was being guided from within. 
However, despite their best efforts, scientists couldn't fully explain its unusual movement. As mentioned earlier in this video, the leading theory suggests that Oumuamua propelled itself by releasing hydrogen gas, enabling it to navigate our solar system effectively. Yet, even this theory leaves unanswered questions. One puzzle scientists did manage to solve, though, was tracing Oumuamua's point of origin. By carefully analyzing its speed and trajectory, they determined it likely came from the vicinity of the star Vega. Vega, a star in the northern constellation Lyra, is 57 times brighter than our Sun and estimated to be about 455 million years old. It's nearly halfway through its main sequence life, after which it will evolve into a red giant like Betelgeuse. Despite tracing Oumuamua's path to Vega, scientists believe that the star itself may not have been in the same region when Oumuamua passed by. This means Oumuamua didn't originate from Vega, but simply traveled through its general direction long ago. Oumuamua's interstellar journey suggests it had a 300,000-year head start before approaching our solar system, traveling at an average speed of 5,900 miles per hour. Given its age, Oumuamua predates Vega, and its true origin remains unknown. One compelling theory proposes that Oumuamua is a fragment of a much larger celestial body, possibly a star or planet. Millions of years ago, a catastrophic event may have destroyed its original home, resulting in its creation. This theory helps explain Oumuamua's unique characteristics. Another study, published in Nature Astronomy, speculates that Oumuamua may have formed under tidal forces similar to those affecting Earth's oceans. Oumuamua's discovery in 2017 was a momentous occasion for astronomers. Detected by the Pan-STARRS-1 telescope in Hawaii, it was the first interstellar object observed passing through our solar system. Unlike typical comets or asteroids originating within our solar neighborhood, Oumuamua's hyperbolic trajectory and extraordinary speed immediately suggested it came from beyond. This realization sparked intense debate within the scientific community. Was Oumuamua a comet, asteroid, or something entirely new? Initially, its unusual shape, a highly elongated body that appeared to be at least 10 times longer than it was wide, challenged existing categorizations. While its elongated shape could result from natural processes, some researchers have speculated about alternative explanations, including the possibility of artificial origins. Harvard astrophysicist Avi Loeb famously suggested that Oumuamua could be a piece of alien technology. In his controversial paper, he hypothesized that its peculiar acceleration, particularly as it moved away from the sun, might indicate the presence of a light sail, a thin reflective surface designed for propulsion using stellar radiation. This theory, while dismissed by many scientists as speculative, underscores how Oumuamua's anomalies continue to defy easy explanations. Adding to the intrigue, Oumuamua displayed non-gravitational acceleration, a deviation from the expected path dictated by gravity alone. Typically, comets exhibit such behavior due to the release of gas and dust as they approach the sun, a process known as outgassing. However, Oumuamua lacked the visible coma or tail typically associated with comets, leaving scientists puzzled. Some researchers have proposed that Oumuamua's acceleration could result from the outgassing of hydrogen trapped within its icy structure. As the sun's heat warmed the object, this hydrogen could have been released in small amounts, providing enough thrust to alter its trajectory. Others argue that its acceleration might stem from factors not yet fully understood, such as unique surface properties or chemical compositions. Unfortunately, the opportunity to study Oumuamua directly ended in January 2019, when it left our solar system and headed toward the constellation Pegasus. As it moved away, it accelerated and eventually disappeared from view, continuing to fluctuate in speed, which made it difficult to track. It traveled faster than any spacecraft we currently possess, making further observations challenging. Now, the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, offers hope for unraveling Oumuamua's secrets. With its ability to capture data from as far as 28 billion light-years away, the JWST could potentially observe the object within the Pegasus constellation, just 700 light-years away. However, given Oumuamua's incredible speed, there's a possibility it might still evade the telescope's view. In addition to the JWST, future interstellar probes are being conceptualized to explore objects like Oumuamua. 
One such mission is Breakthrough Starshot, an ambitious project aiming to develop ultra-fast, light-powered spacecraft capable of reaching nearby stars. If successfully deployed, such probes could revolutionize our understanding of interstellar phenomena by providing close-up observations of objects like Oumuamua.